company quartermaster Havaldar Abdul Hamid was born on 1st July 1933 in Dhamapur village to Mr. Mohammad Usman and Mrs. Sakina Begum. He had two sisters and three brothers. In 1953 at the age of 20 he joined the Indian Army. He trained at the Grenadiers Regimental Center in Nasirabad and was posted to Fort Grenadiers in 1955. Abdul Hamid served with his battalion in Agra, Amritsar, Jammu and Kashmir, Delhi, Northeast Frontier Agency and Ramgarh. On 24th April 1965, the Pakistan army attacked Indian territory in the run of Kutch and penetrated 6 to 8 miles inside the Indian territory. The Pakistani forces subsequently intruded in Kashmir with the launch of Operation Gibraltar. During the Battle of Asal Uttar and Khem Karan, four grenadiers as part of four mountain division was deployed in the Khem Karan sector in Punjab. Four grenadiers arrived at Khem Karan sector on 8 September. At 0730 hours on 8 September, the rumbling of a large number of enemy tanks were heard. At 0900 hours, a troop of patrons came astride the road. The battalion held their fire and when the leading tank was 30 yards away Abdul Hamid mounted on the passenger side of his jeep and under the cover of the sugarcane field charged the recoilless gun on the enemy tanks knocking out two of them The crew of the two follow-up tanks abandoned them and fled On 10 September 1965 around 0800 hours Pakistani forces attacked the vital sector ahead of the village of Chima on the Bikiven road in the Khem Karan sector with a regiment of Patriot tanks. Abdul Hamid, commander of the recoilless gun detachment, moved out to a flanking position with his gun mounted on a jeep amidst heavy enemy shelling and tank fire. He quickly changed positions after taking advantage of a favorable location to take out the leading enemy tank and knocking out another two of them. Abdul Hamid continued firing his recoilless gun without ceasing. He was fatally wounded while trying to engage another tank by an enemy's high explosive shell. He showed total disregard for his own safety throughout the operation, exhibiting unwavering bravery in the face of persistent enemy fire and did so in the greatest traditions of the Indian Army. Inspired by the courageous deed of Abdul Hamid, his companions put up a valiant resistance and repulsed the enemy's massive tank onslaught. The outstanding gallantry of Abdul Hamid contributed immensely to the outcome of the battle. The Battle of Asal Uttar was a setback for Pakistan. For his remarkable achievement, exemplary bravery, Company Quartermaster Havildar Abdul Hamid was awarded the nation's highest gallantry award, Paramvir Chakra, posthumously.